everyone. You're welcome to today's edition of Thursday L Tips with Laya. So on today's edition, I'll be talking about the good and the bad cholesterol. This is very important because it appears that a lot of our diets in one way or the other includes cholesterol. Cholesterol is a fat-like substance produced in the liver naturally and it performs a lot of important functions in the body such as the production of vitamin D, production of some important hormones, production of some substances required in the digestion of our food. So many functions cholesterol it needs in the liver. Cholesterol can also be gotten from diet in which I will be talking about later in this video. So we have two major types of cholesterol. We have the good cholesterol and we have the bad cholesterol. The good cholesterol is usually referred to as the high density lipoprotein in short HDL and the bad cholesterol is usually referred to as the low density lipoprotein. In short we have L DL as shown on the screen is the bad cholesterol which causes buildup of fat known as plaques in the walls of the arteries the arteries are the blood vessels that take blood away from the heart and this causes restriction of blood flow through the arteries. thus there's less blood flow to other parts of the body and less nutrients reach the other part of the body most importantly oxygen less oxygen reach other there are several causes of the buildup of the bad fat in the body and a larger percentage of this cause goes to our diet you see why our diet is very important number one on healthy diet that is excessive consumption of food high in trans fat and saturated fat remember i said excessive consumption not that we should not eat them but we should eat them less often and in low quantity number two physical activity lack of physical activity can cause build up of this low density lipoprotein in the body engaging in physical activity will help to burn down these calories to the barest minimum and refer to the video on physical activity i will drop the link to the video in the description below the effect of this build up or the load that still protein is that it can lead to some heart related diseases affect the normal body functions remember that low density lipoprotein causes build up of plaques thus restricting blood flow nutrients and oxygen to other parts of moving the on body. to the good fat The list is inexhaustible. The high level of the bad fat might not show visible signs. The good part is that you can go for a simple cholesterol test to know whether you have high level of the low density lipoprotein that is the bad fat or high level of the good fat and you know whether to make adjustments or not so you can go to the nearby pharmacy the nearby laboratory or the nearby hospital to get yourself tested and know your stand don't be deceived high level of the bad fat is not a function of whether you're looking fat or you're looking slim so go get your cholesterol test thank you so much for liking thank you so much for watching and thank you for keeping up with l tips with liar if you have not subscribed don't forget to hit the subscribe button below. See you next week. Bye.